So I want to make this short video just on uh, understanding how the range estimation works on a Chevy Volt um, first generation. You can see my battery shows that I have 30 miles of range remaining. When I left my house this morning with a full charge, it was estimating 35 miles. Uh, the reason it's 35 instead of 40 or 42 like it has been earlier this year is mainly because of the heat. It's very hot. Um, it's August and also have been driving a fair amount on the freeway and you know cranking the AC. So those three things, speed, um, your HVAC system, and uh, ambient temperature have a lot to do with your range. So what you can see is it's only deducted five miles off of my range from when I started, but I've actually traveled 13.1 miles. Um, and this is more indicative of the wintertime driving where I started with this car. You can see I've gone 13.2 miles on three kilowatt hours. That um, That's pretty good. That's um, beating the four miles per kilowatt hour kind of threshold that seems to be the um, kind of the ideal uh, range under gentle conditions for this car. So anyways, there, there it is, a quick video that shows that uh, these two meters act independently. This is an estimated range based off of the driving history, the recent history of the car. Um, so you've got you've got that estimated battery range, and you've got your actual odometer down there, and then you've got mileage over here. So it's an interesting um, setup once you understand how it works.